How we doing today, folks? This is your old pals, Demo and Zoner, and we have brought you out here to the middle of nowhere. It's beautiful, though. Knows where? To show you our wood. <laughs> and this is known as the Lund, George Lund Petrified Forest. Yeah. Used to be Leadville Petrified Forest first. Change it to George Lund. George Lund is the man who through tireless efforts, saved this area yeah. for posterity from mining companies who were digging it up and doing whatever they were doing with it. Yeah, uranium miners and then people saw the petrified wood and they were up here with bulldozers loading trucks up and taking it. Yeah, I mean, look at this. Look at the size. Yeah. Look at the extent. Yeah, there's, there's a chunk right there. This is what you call, this is like John Holmes size petrified wood right here. Nice. What is it, 16 and a half mil? Yeah, it's about 16. The uh, big sequoia tree is what this was, redwood. Yeah. 16 and a half million years ago, this was a alpine forest. There were glaciers here. There were streams and rivers and lakes, and now look. Yeah. Look at what we got here. Yeah, just imagine, nice lush forest here. Makes you wonder about the global warming that they say about nowadays. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. But anyway, I mean, look at this, look at this. Look at this. Jagged peaks, it's like Africa over here, it's beautiful. Well, we got... We, we got we, Shane here with us too. We got, we got Bubba. Bubba came out. <laughs> Bubba came to Bubba play. Bubba was hiding for a while. I don't know why. I guess we scared him. Bastard. But now he's back. Nah, yeah. he didn't scare me. You scared me. Oh, whatever. Yeah. Look at the wood. <laughs> but you go in. Yeah, well. Go in a little path over there. They have this. This whole area is fenced off as 40 acres of protected petrified wood. And please, please leave it for others. Yeah. Please do not steal the petrified wood. Like another another shot at. Got red ants crawling up my leg. Nice. Uh oh. But uh, Just don't pour any white gas on them. George W. Lund Memorial Petrified Forest. This area is so named in the memory of George W. Lund, 1897-1964. His untiring efforts in the preservation of petrified wood in Nevada and his work in conservation in this state. Uh, receive respectful acknowledgement with the dedication of this monument, erected in 1965. And of course, you see at the base of it, giant slab petrified yep. wood. Petrified wood. So, oh yes, come along with us, and uh, we're going to take you on a guided tour of this area full of petrified wood. Yeah. All right. Let's, let's go. Let's do it up. All right. Let's go. And Bubba's out enjoying himself today. So is Demo. Look at that. Captain Morgan. Standing on petrified wood. I bet you make that, that makes you feel real tall, doesn't it? Standing on top of petrified wood like that. Yeah. It does. You wouldn't be so tall if you wasn't standing on there. Yeah. <laughs> you see, you can count the rings right here. Oh, yeah. So one, two, three. It was an old tree. This is a big one. Right there. These guys with sequoias. Nice. You got agatized petrified wood. Oh yeah, and the country is, I mean, just gorgeous. Yeah, and you listen to that. Nothingness. Yep. Silence. It's so quiet out here, you can't hear Bubba. What? <laughs> Man, did you blow that one up? Yeah, I blew it. Oh, well. Did you say 16 and a half million years old? Yeah. And just think, the age it got to get that big. Yeah. Happen. My God, that is massive. Yeah, this is just gorgeous out here. 
This is the Black Rock Desert, folks. In all of its glory. What a day. All right, well, we're in the old mining camp of Leadville, Nevada. Leadville. And uh, current residents. Four cows. And Shane. <laughs> Shane. Yes, me. Definitely me. <laughs> so we're going to take a look around. Looks like we've got to just got to watch out for the uh, cow plop. But wow, we could make it. what a view. Oh my God. <laughs> <Damn>. <laughs> what a view. The amount of material that they moved out of that mine is just incredible. Yeah, we don't know much about this town, but we're guessing there was a lot of wealth here. This is the last building. Anything in there? Hi, I'm Bob Vila. On this old episode of This Old Shack, we're going to show you how to fix her up and make money. So let's go. Let's go. Oh, yeah, it's a fixer upper, all right. Man. No doubt about that. Woo. Good lord. Yeah. You can see the, the tongue and tongue and groove. And the insulators. Here. This was a this was a early nineteen hundreds uh, operation. Yeah. I'd probably say about nineteen thirties, nineteen twenties. Sounds about right. Here in the Black Rock, this is where, that's right, the magic of Nevada happens in September. Burning Man. This is where the magic happens, folks. This is what uh, what people believe is the entirety of the Black Rock Desert, which yeah. it is not. If you look straight right that way, right there, that's where uh, Burning Man happens. Right straight out there. Watch out. This. We're going to go hit the fly and uh, see how fast we can get the truck up to. I say we... This is going to, this is going to be like our Bonneville. <laughs> <laughs> I say we do it, brother. Yeah. Let's head on out. Yeah, and Bubba, Bubba's getting excited. Bubba's getting very excited, as you can hear. <laughs> okay, Bubba, we're coming. <laughs> Right. Well, here Demo shows you how to fly her on the plier. Probably 100 miles an hour isn't really probably something we should do, huh? No, probably not. Right, but slow. it's still cool, nonetheless. Let's, let's slow it down to 80. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, so you just let go, just let go of the steering wheel and just let, let the let fly. Let drive. All right. What's up, everybody? Hopefully the wind's not too bad. I'm destroying this, the audio here, but we'll talk loud for you. Today's finds, start with uh, Mr. Shane there. 
Shane got a bunch of obsidian piece of slag that Demo actually found and I think I'm going to take that home and put that in my furnace and re-smelt re it see what comes of it and then my girlfriend she goes off and she finds a big old freaking hunk of nothing but Galena how do you like that silver yeah. ore folks she outdoes us all I swear to god that girl's got a nose for this kind of stuff all right then we got mine right here very colorful piece pitch fat wood we got, and you got these this stuff here this is just gorgeous some of these are gonna be i'll try to cut some of them and see if we can get some eyes yes yeah, just egg it turned it into agate totally agatized it's like one, it's one. like caramelized this one's got a little uh salmon salmon pink to it yeah Colors, nice. And these guys here, these are nice. And it's petrified wood, still got the bark on it. Bark? Wolf. Yeah. That one too. Nice banding. And we got Demo stuff here. Demo found some good stuff. Not as much. Found uh, this one. I think this one has the thumbprint in it. This one, is that the one? Yeah, I don't know if it picks up on the camera. See that white area? Yeah. Kind of looks like a like a fingerprint. And it does. And just uh, warped wood. <laughs> I just spent too much time in the wind. <laughs> well, obviously, yeah, I didn't spend I was, enough time around you guys. I was gonna I was gonna say there's another reason it's warped, but I ain't gonna go there. <laughs> <laughs> Then just a bunch of obsidian, Apache tears is what they call Yeah, it is. this stuff's all over the place. Yeah. Cut some of that up and make some, make some nice stuff. Make some nice yeah. pretty stuff. Pretty all stuff. right. Well, we got one more place we got to hit. Yeah. Yeah, we do. One more place. Yep, we're going to uh, show you the palms. Yeah, let's check them out. How we doing, folks? We are uh, going to close out the video today in the Black Rock Desert. It was a beautiful hot spring. All kinds of little minnows swimming around in there. It's a trip. But, uh, yep. yeah, it was a heck of a day. Heck of a day. Yes, it was. Found some uh, petrified uh, wood. We showed you that. Then, let's see, what else we do today? Uh, Got all kinds of obsidian. Yeah, obsidian. Then we tried to find that uh, high, high Rock Canyon. The High Rock Canyon. We couldn't find the road. Turn. Yeah, off. Demo got lost. Oh no! <laughs> Anybody could get lost out there. Especially you two. <laughs> hey, <laughs> I just drive whatever direction the truck wants to go. <laughs> like I said, especially you two. Oh yeah. You know, give me that. And then but we you, went and. Saw some kind of mine. Leadville. Oh, it went yeah, to Leadville. Leadville. Oh, yeah. Mining camp of Leadville. That was cool. Because mm. uh, this guy finds a solid chunk of galena. Wasn't me. My girlfriend. Yeah, solid that, chunk. Yeah. Silver ore. Or what? Or exactly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, we figured that uh, out. Sung too. This is a tick. Yes, it is. Gimme. Tickwify him. Well, anyways, watch your... got smudged. Watch yourselves. Yep. Oh, we're going to go ahead and head on out of here and get some exceedingly cold to drink. Somewhere. Somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> and on top of that, we're upsetting the cows. So I think it's time for us to go. Yep. Thank yeah. you. Thank you, as always, for all the support. Definitely appreciate it, folks. We really do. And, uh, yeah. We Don't forget to share these videos, all right? It was a great day. Another great day out. Yes, it That's was. It was good to get out. It always is. Always is. So, without any further... Yeah, I do. I do. Hmm. It's been your old pals... Demo. Zoner. Bubba. Bubba. <laughs> saying, Don't, Don't let, let your, your meatloaf. Thanks a lot. Y'all take care. Bye-bye.